This is how to get social media traffic on autopilot for free for an entire year. Plus, we are going to use artificial intelligence to do the heavy lifting so you can have the whole system up and running in less than 10 minutes from now. So welcome to ProfitCopilot.com. It's Mick Meany here. And by the end of this lesson, you will know how to get traffic from platforms like Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, LinkedIn, TikTok, practically any social media platform you like. Plus, we are going to batch everything. So we're going to create hundreds of social media posts in bulk and we only need three tools to do it. So we're going to need some AI software. I'm going to use Google Bard and I'll explain why later on. We also need Canva or similar. And then lastly, we need a social media scheduler. I'm going to recommend two later on. But listen up, this is important because getting traffic is great and all but it needs to convert, right? It needs to generate sales. It needs to make money for you. So if you want me to take this idea further, I will show you how to monetize it. Just tell me in the comments and I will go ahead and create that tutorial if you want it. Okay, let's go to the computer and I'll show you how to drive traffic from social media for free for an entire year. Okay, head to Google and type in Google Bard. Now this is Google's very own AI tool. And there's a specific reason why we are using this over one of the many, many other options that we have available to us. We're using this because, well, let me show you a prompt that I added previously. So I have asked the AI to give me 30 motivational quotes about weight loss and add them to a spreadsheet. This is the important bit. So of course you will have to decide how many motivational quotes you want and for which niche. I'm choosing 30 for weight loss. Now this depends on your posting schedule. If you're posting once a week, then you're gonna need 52 motivational quotes. If you're posting once a day, then you're going to need 365. It's entirely up to you. You can bulk this out and have a year's worth of social media posts ready to go if you want to. So here, it's generated that for us. And if we scroll down to the bottom, here we have export to sheets. This is the important part. So click on, on sheets. It's going to open up the file in Google Sheets automatically for you. And it's going to give you those same two columns that we can see here. So we've got author and quote. So there we have quote and author. And then I'm going to download this spreadsheet. So I'm going to click on file, download. And I want to download it as a CSV. Once that's done, I'm going to head to Canva and I'm going to click on create design. Here we have Instagram story. Now, I think this is probably the best size for a lot of social media, including TikTok videos. For this example, I'm just going to create static images. So I'm going to click on Instagram story. And now we have the right dimensions. If we go to design on the left hand side and then search story templates. And let's think about what we're doing here. So I'm going to create posts that contain a quote. So I'm going to search for quotes. And then we have lots of templates to choose from. Now we want it to look relevant to our niche. So maybe I could add in weight loss. So let's choose a nice template here. We could go with this one. That's nice and simple. Now we want to make a few changes here. So obviously you can change the background if you want to can add in a different image. You can play around with the font, size of the text and all that good stuff if you want to, that's fine. But if you have just one text field here, what you need to do is add a second one. So let's go to text here on the left hand side and then we can add a text box. I'm just gonna use a very small one here, click on that. There it's added in. I'm gonna change this a little bit. So I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger and then I'm going to change the position of the main text here. I'm not going to play around with this too much because I just want to get up and running and show you. But once we're happy with how it looks, then that's where things get really interesting. OK, before we move on to the next step, now you already know that traffic is the most important thing that you need. So take a look at how I got more than four million hits every month to one of my websites for free. I want to show you when you go to profitcopilot.com slash traffic and you will get the same strategies that my student used 
to make $2 million online for free. Okay, let's head back and take a look at the next step. So we've got two text boxes here. Now what we wanna do is get all the content from your spreadsheet added into fields here. I'll show you how to do that automatically. So on the left hand side, click on apps, then scroll down to more from Canva, click on bulk create. And now we upload the CSV file that we downloaded from Google Sheets. So this file here, we've downloaded it to our computer. Now we wanna upload it to Canva. When we do that, we now have two fields here. We have quote and author, just like the columns in, in Google Sheets. So now what we need to do is align or connect the quote with the quote field here and the author with the text box here. We can do that really easily by right clicking over the text, then go to connect data and here we have quote or author to choose from. So I'm going to click on quote and there it's added it to the text field. I'm going to do the same thing for the author box here. Right click, connect data, and then choose author. And now we click continue. I'm going to click generate and then watch what happens. It's going to open a brand new window and we can see that Canva has automatically generated about 30 images for us automatically and added the quote for each one into a brand new image that we can just go ahead and download. So now we can schedule these to social media. When it comes to that task, I use Content Studio. I believe it is the best one that I have found so far, but Content Studio is very intuitive. I recommend it so much that I, mean, I am gonna put my affiliate link in the description for you. Let me show you what it looks like for me. So we can see that I've got a few days worth of social media content scheduled here. It's ready to go. And if I want to post something on, let's say I wanna post something on the 14th. I will click the plus icon there, then I can upload an image, I can add all my tags, I can choose the channels that I want it to be posted automatically to, and it will just work as expected because you might be wondering, well, why don't we just use the Canva social media tool? Because we can schedule things through Canva too. And the reason why I don't recommend using that is because in a lot of cases, it will use push notifications. So what that means is, it will send a message to your phone for you to manually add the content to the social media channels. It doesn't work like that for every social media channel, but when I was doing my testing, it did it enough to make me not want to use the social media calendar inside Canva. And that is why I go with Content Studio instead, because it doesn't need push notifications. It will just automatically post to social media when I need it to, without bothering me, without me having to do anything manually, and I can just get on with other tasks or spend my time however I like. Now, one thing I really like about Content Studio is the, the Discover tab. So if we click on Discover, it makes content curation really easy. So we can set up our topics here, and then we can choose from a wide range of stories that are happening in your niche, and then we can schedule them in, in advance. One more thing we can do with Content Studio is bulk upload. So if we go to Compose, click on Automation, we can now upload hundreds of social media posts all in one go, and we can schedule them through a spreadsheet similar to the one that we looked at earlier. In fact, it gives you a template file to use, but it's not the only option. I used to use Buffer. I absolutely loved Buffer, but it just couldn't do the content creation aspect that Content Studio does. Okay, so now you have an entire year's worth of social media traffic on tap for free, but this is just the beginning because I do want to show you how to monetize this idea for passive income. If you want that tutorial, tell me in the comments. And also remember to get that free course on how I got more than 4 million hits a month for free and how Matt Feast used the same methods to make over $2 million online. Okay, get that for free when you go to profitcopilot.com 
slash traffic. Thank you for being here today. It means the world to me and I will hopefully see you again next week. Take care and God bless.